If you have scoliosis or a posture condition, you may be asking yourself why the Schroth method? Can't I just work on bending the opposite direction and on core strengthening? This is a really common mindset when it comes to scoliosis because it's responding to what we can see with our eyes. If I know that my curve makes me bend one direction, wouldn't it make sense just to go the opposite direction, right? The problem is that scoliosis isn't simply a two-dimensional change in your posture. It's actually a lot more like this band Then once it starts to spiral, that's what actually leads to the shifting to the side that we see. It's usually the rotation that starts the process of the scoliosis we know. This makes sense when you think about the screening for scoliosis. Most of us are familiar with the test in which the screener makes you bend forward and looks for a rib hump on one side of your trunk. This rib hump is an indication that the spine is not only bending, but rotating. Here's where it gets tricky. As you can see in this diagram, the area of the main curvature has shifted over this direction and is rotating. The areas above and below have to shift the opposite direction and counter rotate to keep the body from falling over. In the bottom diagram, you can see this creates dark areas where the trunk has collapsed, as well as when we're talking about the soft tissue, the areas in orange, the soft tissue becomes shortened, and the areas in blue, the soft tissue becomes overstretched. Here lies the beauty of the Schroth method. It addresses each individual's posture specifically and three-dimensionally. It starts with elongation to stretch shortened tissues. The individual is then taught how to correct his or her specific posture to achieve neutral. Once alignment is corrected, collapsed areas are expanding using internal pressures and breath. It is a postural boot camp. The exercises are performed in a variety of positions using wall bars, belts, and wedges to ensure constant maintenance of each person's corrected posture. In the beginning, the therapist is very active to make certain that the exercises are being performed correctly. But with time, individuals can be very independent with the technique without much need for guided sessions at all. So that's the Schroth method in a nutshell. For more information, explore clayscoliosisclinic.com.